Hi, Sagittarius. It's Leslie with your January forecast. First of all, I want to thank you for all your views and for all your subscriptions and all your wonderful comments. Really appreciate it. I truly appreciate it an awful lot. I'm trying to get off the mix. You know, when you put it on, it says mix, and there's others there. I'm trying to get it where we, we have it. Every Everything we do comes on. Of course, if you subscribe, you do get everything we do. Anyway, a private reading re relationship of last minute luck could save the day for you and start an exciting path for your future. A very exciting path for your future. Venus charms her way into your happy sign, enlivening your personality. And, and you have a very happy, enlivening personality. Uh, happy, happy go lucky. Outside make people happy. So to have any more so, how wonderful can you get? You find a certain freshness that makes you feel good. You really do. You, you have that quality. Better patch things up if you have a situation that mm, you've had words with somebody or just didn't agree. Uh, to patch things up would be the best thing, especially this time of year. A friendship story could turn into a love story for a day or forever. So look at that. Woohoo! Woohoo! Hubba hubba! You know? <laughs> um, unfortunately, it is likely that they do not meet your expectations. The person does not. Um, look at the benefits instead of focusing on what is wrong with it. Look at the benefits of the relationship. If something really good is there for you. I mean, nothing is going to be perfect. There will be some good and some bad, you know. Um, look at the, look at it really, really closely. As far as your finances, they are doing well because they are watched closely by the energies of Capricorn. And Capricorn is doing business, always doing business. So make sure it's keeping it right. You do manage your budget accurately, and you do know where you're going with it, and you know how much you have and how much you can spend and how much you need to need to pay for things. Very, very good like that, Sagittarius. Results, results are good, very good for you. Reunite with old friends. This is a good month to reunite, reignite with new friends, old friends, excuse me. The laughter and relationships will be a strong point at the beginning of this year for you. And some old friends will be very, it'll be just, you'll really enjoy getting together with old friends and new friends. And you'll have some more social life than you've had for quite a while. Um, your best days are the 3rd, the 13th, and the 30th. And let's see what the cards have in store for you, Sagittarius. There you are, right there. Getting together with old friends. That's... I think that really is what that means. You know, talking, it says, in the schoolyard, you could have some kind of reunion. You could just be getting together with one of your old friends you haven't seen in a long time. And learning a lot of things about what's going on with everybody. The hermit, the hermit is always wisdom to me. And you'd be very interested to know what's going on, where everybody is, what's happening with them. There we go. There we go. There we go. Well, it ends up in a very happy note, very, very happy note. Um, this, you have, um, you know, as I said in, in, your, in your reading, um, you're, you're very good with money. You know how to hold on to money. You know how to save money. Um, very good with it. And you're going to continue doing that. I see mm, about in March, something's going to come up, and you'll be able to save uh, a little lump of money, which will make you very happy. Like, you save things when people don't know, and you don't, Spend it for anything. Maybe you just kind of hide it or put it where, where you know where it's at. And, and here we are standing up on top of the world, which you've done many times before. Um, no matter what happens, you're standing up, um, not letting things get you down. Stand up, and whatever happens, you just get up, get yourself up again, and start all over again. It's a very good, very good quality you have. And um, if there's a love in your life, there could be two people. One just new, one, one you've had for many years. Um, this one, the, the opposition is just that you've been this person for a long, long time, um, and you don't feel there's quite enough attention coming back to you, or you know, it becomes old hat, maybe you're kind of boring uh, to some people. But actually, Really focus on this one. Focus because see the good and the bad because this will always win out. This one, the person you've been with for a long time. Things just change in relationships as time goes by. Here's a new person. This also could be, it could be, because they're younger. Um, 
a boyfriend of a boyfriend, a son-in-law or something of your um, of your daughters, of your daughters, very much. Uh, someone you haven't seen in a while, somebody new in the picture, is they're going to become uh, related to you by marriage. So, very much so. That's her allergy. And a big celebration is coming up at some time um, with some friends, uh, probably maybe over the Christmas, New Year's holiday in January even. I do think you have other celebrations coming, but it's, it's very it's very enjoyable, very enjoyable. And there's friends, friends you haven't seen in a while either. Very good. Sue so is picking your angel card, which is think with your heart, not your head. Very nice for your reading. Enjoy the holiday. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.